Welcome to Epworth. I'm Dr Bronwyn King, one of the radiation oncologists. Today I'd like to tell you about a special new radiation technique in patients with breast cancer. A technique designed to make your treatment as safe as possible and a technique that you're actively involved in. It's called the Deep Inspiratory Breath Hold Technique. Which is just a fancy way of saying take a deep breath and hold it. Why do we need you to take a deep breath? Well, it has to do with your heart, your lungs, and the area of your body receiving treatment. When you receive radiation therapy to the left side of your chest, your heart is very close to the area receiving the radiation dose. This can potentially pose a long-term risk, especially in patients who have received chemotherapy and patients with a history of heart disease. When patients expand their lungs by taking a deep breath in, the lungs push the heart away from the radiation zone. That makes your radiation therapy safer for your heart. It sounds simple, but there is a bit more to it, so it's worth having a brief look to see what's involved. To begin with, your radiation oncologist, the doctor caring for you during radiation therapy, will review your individual medical case and determine if the deep inspiratory breath hold technique is suitable for your treatment. Lungs, fill this area here, push the heart out of the radiation zone and make the radiation as safe as possible. If it is suitable, you'll talk with a radiation therapist to set up a CT planning session. Together, you will go through some of the practice routines to get you ready for breath holding. The CT planning session is required to prepare for your radiation therapy. The CT scans show the treatment team the exact position of your chest wall and heart and help determine how much your chest wall moves when you hold your breath. A monitoring device takes accurate measurements which will be used when you begin treatment. For you, it's a chance to practice your breath holding in the position you'll be in during treatment. The treatment team will coach you with techniques for effectively holding your breath. When you begin treatment, we'll go through the breath holding steps again. Take a deep breath in and hold. Great work, and breathe out. When everything is ready and you're comfortable, we'll begin your radiation therapy. The special monitoring devices give the radiation therapist precise information to guide the radiation beams. From the treatment bed, you'll hear the radiation therapist ask you to take a deep breath, just like you've practiced. And breathe out. Your deep inspiratory breath hold moves the heart away from the treatment area allowing the radiation therapist to safely deliver the targeted dose of radiation therapy. The special monitoring devices ensure that the patient is breathing in deeply before any radiation is delivered. Take a deep breath in and hold. The treatment machines will automatically pause if patients are not at the correct point in the breathing cycle. Once the monitors detect that the patient is ready to go again, the treatment restarts. And breathe out, that's good. Your treatment will last several weeks. During that time, a nurse will meet with you on a weekly basis to monitor your health and well-being, and your radiation oncologist will review your progress regularly. Of course, you are welcome to ask questions at any time during the preparation, treatment or review process. Thanks very much. The Deep Inspiratory Breath Hold Technique delivers radiation therapy in the safest way possible. Thanks for watching. 